Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Benzita Pinto, Consultant Rheumatologist, Manipal Hospital, Sarjapur Road and today I'm going to speak to you about a very important disease, Rheumatoid Arthritis. Rheumatoid Arthritis is an autoimmune disease which primarily affects the joints. So when we talk of arthritis, arthritis indicates pain and swelling of the joints. Arthritis can be seen as a manifestation of more than 100 diseases and Rheumatoid Arthritis is one among them. Although it is most common in women of reproductive age group, that is women in their 30s and 40s, rheumatoid arthritis can occur in both genders and at any extreme and both extremes of age. Rheumatoid arthritis is an autoimmune disease. It occurs because of your immunity misfiring and damaging the body's own tissues. So like all autoimmune diseases, there is a genetic background with genetics being the most important risk factor. However, certain environmental factors such as smoking and other lifestyle factors have also been found to have an increased risk of rheumatoid arthritis. So the diagnosis of rheumatoid arthritis is based on the clinical symptoms and signs of the patient. So when a patient comes to us, he usually presents with pain and swelling of the joints that is present for at least six weeks. So joints which are involved typically are both small as well as the large joints. So the small joints of the hand, the wrists, the elbows, the shoulders, the knees, the ankles, these are typically affected and usually they're affected on both sides of the body. Although atypical presentations can also occur. Rheumatoid arthritis are treated by drugs which modulate the immunity because like I said, this is an autoimmune disease. The important thing to understand is that although there is no cure, there is very effective treatment is available for rheumatoid arthritis which enables a person to lead an almost normal life with treatment. Thank you.